So check this out. I've got one of these great interactive presentations that I want to share with my students, but I don't want them to see this inside Google Slides view. I want them just to access the presentation view. So this is how I'm going to do it. I'm going to go up here and I'm going to grab this URL. So I'm going to need to select the whole thing and copy it. Now I'm going to go over to Seesaw where I'm going to post this. So I'm going to click on this plus sign and post student work. I'm going to select link and then I'm going to drop this link right in here. But before I post it, I want to get rid of everything after this last slash. So get rid of edit number slide ID and I'm going to type the word present. Then I'm going to click on my green check marks. Everything's good. This is what I want. I'm going to assign it to any students. All right, now this is what my students get. And as long as they click on it, they're going to get that link and it's going to come right up. It's going to be in presentation mode. As soon as it's ready, I it loaded. So I'm just going to click on it and I can get started. And you can see that the students can still interact with this the way that the teachers intended. Okay, so this is also what you're going to want to do if you're doing those fun Bitmoji scenes. Just as a side note, you want to copy this link because a lot of us are linking things into our slides. And so if you're doing that, then you want to copy this link. And then wherever you paste it, just make sure that at the very end, you, go, you get rid of anything that's before that slash. Type the word present. And there you go. Now it is going to be interactive so that the user is able to click on your links and be taken to the websites that you've linked in there.